hydrocarbon particles that can cause health problems in adults and children are getting into the placenta as it nourishes a developing fetus, a new study by Belgian researchers has found. According to a report published recently in Nature Communications, soot emitted through the incomplete combustion of fossil fuels contains harmful black carbon. These particles can pass through the protective barrier of the placenta and enter the fetus tissue. Professor Tim Naurut, who led the study, said mothers who had been subjected to higher levels of pollution registered a larger concentration of harmful particles in their placentas. So they can really pass from the mother sides of the placenta to the fetal side. Uh, and then they are in the same blood compartment uh, of the fetus itself. The placenta is supposed to be a barrier that protects the fetus from substances that might harm it. Whether those particles created by the combustion of fossil fuels pose a direct risk to the fetus is an unresolved question. But the researchers speculate that the pollutants may play a role in the low birth weight or premature delivery more often seen in babies whose mothers are exposed to higher levels of contaminated air. Such particles have also been known to slow cognitive abilities, and they've been seen in the urine of healthy children and in the brain at autopsy. More research is necessary to demonstrate the precise health effects the presence of pollutants has on a developing fetus. The Hassel team hopes to visualize and analyze the effects of these particles in the future. What mothers can do now uh, practically is like if they are living in, in a big city and they uh, walk or have to, to choose their cycling path, uh, maybe avoid the, the most, uh, well, the, the, the major roads, take a parallel street with less traffic because we know that within a city uh, there can be a, a large, uh, well, a large variation even on very small uh, distance. Mirasol Abugadil, UNTV, News and Rescue.